It's a very significant moment for Bosnia and Herzegovina, you know, a country in Eastern Europe that just 30 years ago was involved in a devastating war. Now, we just heard that from the president of the European Commission, Ursula von der Leyen, who called this a historic decision. And, you know, this is something that the country had been waiting for for a long, long time. Just to give you some background, Bosnia was identified as a potential potential EU candidate back in 2003 and that means that they've been waiting more than 20 years for this day. Now in terms of what happens next, uh, it's only the start of the process. Just because a country is given candidate status, it doesn't mean it's going to join the EU anytime soon. And in fact, EU accession talks are renowned in Brussels for being painfully slow and extremely complicated. I mean, the whole process normally takes at least a decade. And that's because countries have to fulfill all sorts of legal and economic criteria before they're able to join. But what matters here is that the political will is there. I mean, since Russia invaded Ukraine, European leaders have become acutely aware of the Russian threat, which could extend beyond Ukraine. And because of that, they are now quite keen for countries in Eastern Europe to join the EU. So all in all, today, a historic day for Bosnia, which is now on the path to joining the European Union.